Hello, it is me, the Grand Dame. No, I am not average. I was just enjoying myself with some YouTube videos. It is such a nice way to enjoy other people's holidays during these weird times. Especially the vlog about that brown Labrador, so nice. And what a big camper they are traveling with. Oh my, way too big for me. But I now need to do something different. The guys from culture-lovers.eu have called me this morning and asked if I could do something for them. I feel so honored. I get a role in their videos. They want me to this week's update for them. I am so excited. Don Quixote, the sweetheart, that normally would do this, is a bit under the weather. So this gives me an opportunity to present myself on the channel. To be honest, it makes me quite nervous. All this work with cameras and computers. Normally, it is only my tea, makeup and hairspray that I am worried about. Luckily he left me a little note with some topics for this update. So, let's give it a try. As a first point Don Quixote has put on the list for me that I can tell you that the owners of the channel have sold their place in Rotterdam. They lived there for over 20 years. What a nice place was that. I have been there many times. It was really in the heart of the city. In five minutes you could walk to the Bayingkorf, the Marktplatz or the Leinbahn. Just awesome to be there. Rotterdam has become such a nice city. Now, they live in Rormand. Also, very nice, but totally different. They do not work their ass off anymore. They embrace life now in a much more relaxed way. They focus themselves on a mix between travel and farming, quite interesting. As you know, with regard to travel they want to buy a camper to go and hunt for culture. You can follow their preparations here on the channel. This brings me to the second and third point on my sweetheart's list. The planning and the camper. The team seems to be almost ready to order a camper. The problem it quite likely creates is that as a consequence of the, the delivery times, they will never be able to start with their trip right in the new year. They expect now that it will take at least till Easter before they can start making test trips. So, the original idea to be in Spain with the Tamborada in January is off the table. They are now thinking about starting much closer to home for 2022. Festivals in Belgium, Germany, the north of France and the Netherlands seem much more appropriate. So, somewhere in the near future, that is when they have clarity on when they will have a camper they will come with a new planning. Knowing him, I expect that trips to Leipzig, Karlsruhe, Ural etc. will quite likely be on the list for next year. Also, as soon as we learn what kind of camper they have ordered, we'll make a session in which we explain the reasons behind it. The fourth point on the list is about cooking. We've got our instant pot delivered. Chef Pellegrino is now experimenting with it, and relying on his broad smiles, he seems to be very pleased. Every now and then, he shares some results, and we love it. I am sure that it will not take too long before we can share our first episode in the Instant Pot Cooking in a Camper series. As a fifth and sixth point I have the drone and vlog camera on the list. For both these points it has become very clear that they need to reserve quite some time to practice. And that is what they do. The first tryouts show how much they are struggling. But no worries, just have some patience. They will get there. Eventually. They just need to make sure that they are ready as soon as the camper arrives, and that will take some time. For me personally it is good to see that the others are struggling with these new technologies as well. It is good to see that I am not the only one. Let us enjoy some of their experiments. Okay, and as a last, seventh point, I am supposed to tell you more about the topics that will soon follow. The list of draft topics they gave me are, 1. The Instant Pot Cooking Series. As was already mentioned. 2. Possible destinations, events or festivals that we consider for getting started once we have our camper. 3. Strawman packing lists. They are already thinking through what they expect to need once they start traveling. And 4. I guess I mentioned already, an update in which we will walk you through the reasoning behind our order for a camper. So, that was it, my first session with culture-lovers.eu. I hope that I did not frighten you off. While I go off and have my sherry, 
I hope that you give my episode a thumb up and subscribe to the channel. See you all next week.